Yo, what's going on, YouTube family? It's a beautiful day in the A. And you're locked in the B2 Speaks. I am Walter. For those of you who are new to the channel, we talk about trucking, conservative politics, everything on this channel, and sometimes it's going to offend you. So if you don't mind, subscribe to the channel and I uh, hope you like what you see. Let's talk about pay. I've gotten a few comments on some older videos from new drivers and I absolutely love new truck drivers. I love to get communication and feedback from new drivers on videos that I make. I like to see where they're going, what their plans are, just so that I can help answer any questions. I've been driving trucks for about eight years. I've been an owner operator. I've been a company driver. I've been over the road, local, regional dedicated i like to say that i kind of sort of know what i'm talking about a little bit when it comes to trucking just a little bit not everything do over the road truck drivers make more money than local guys the biggest misconception out there is that you have to be over the road in order to make money in trucking that is not true in fact that's a lie most local jobs nowadays you're gonna make equal if not way more than what you'll make being over the road there's so much going on right now over the road uh with the freight especially truckload freight with the rates that's happening there's still some supply chain issues going on that's affecting companies truckload side of their business and there's still a lot of congestion that people are not talking about at the ports. And a lot of port freight is truckload freight. And it's just still a mess. And we're not even gonna get into, on this video, the idiots in Washington, D.C. and the moron in the White House that's uh, green policy that they're trying to force on everybody. You do not have to be over the road in order to make money as a truck driver. My recommendation is for new truck drivers. If you're just getting a CDL, fresh out of CDL school, I do not recommend you to start local. Guys don't like it when I say that. I get all kind of nasty comments on videos when I speak about starting over the road instead of local. And I always get guys saying that they don't agree with me or they don't like me because of my opinion about that. They jump in and say, hey, I started over, I started local and I'm making all of this money and I've never driven over the road and I've never had any problems. And, you know, that can happen. I'm not saying that it can't happen. It can happen. What I'm saying is when you are a new driver, you need to start over the road because it's a little bit of a slower pace than these local jobs. Local jobs are a lot faster. Uh, the, you're being counted for productivity a lot more than you are as an over the road driver. And over the road delivery and pickup appointments, they're spaced out enough to give you time so that you don't have to rush backing, trying to get into a dock and you end up hitting something or trying to make turns in these crazy places, trying to back in these crazy places, and you end up having accidents before you even really start your career, and you completely destroy your CDL before you even get started. That's the only way, reason why I recommend over the road driver driving is strictly, strictly for those new guys just getting out there, just getting started, you need to get experience, at least in my opinion, at least a minimum of eight months. After that, go get your local jobs where you're home every day or home every other day. And you can actually have a life as well as drive trucks. That's one of the things that I get a lot in uh, comments now. Some guys asking me, hey, uh, the recruiter said that I should go with their company and not start local because of the money. They don't talk about, hey, you should start local for safety reasons or you should start over the road for safety reasons. They go straight to the money portion. And that's just not true. You can make just as much money local as you can being gone all the time 
uh, as an over the road driver. And I'm not talking about owner operators. This is not anything. This is not a video addressing owner operators. We know that that's a whole different animal in itself. I'm speaking about local company driving jobs and local over the road jobs. Well, not local over the road jobs. That don't make sense. <laughs> but I'm talking about company over the road jobs. So yeah, I just wanted to address that. No, you do not have to start over the road, but I recommend it and no, it's not true that the only way to make money in trucking is to be over the road. That's not true. That's far from the truth. Local jobs pay just as much money. You're getting home every day. A lot of them pay you by the hour. So you're being paid for all of your time. Not all of them pay overtime like they should. Most of them just pay you straight pay, but nevertheless, you're still getting paid for every hour that you work and you can end up making a lot more money than you make as a over the road driver being home every day. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section, man. I'm gonna go hook up to this trailer, head to pick up this load, and I'll see you on the next one.